black diamonds, especially carbonado, a natural polycrystalline diamond, at home can be challenging since they're very hard and often opaque, which makes traditional diamond testers less effective. However, here are several safe and practical tests you can try at home to get an idea if a stone might be a carbonado diamond. Important note, these tests won't give 100% confirmation, but can help rule out obvious fakes. For a definitive identification, you'll need a gemologist or a lab test. One, visual inspection with a loop or magnifying glass. Look for porous surface. Carbonado often looks like charcoal or rough asphalt. Metallic luster. It may have a subtle shiny or oily appearance. Irregular shape. Carbonado diamonds usually aren't transparent or faceted naturally. If it looks like glass or plastic, it's likely fake. Two, check for inclusions or sparkle. Black diamonds are very opaque and should not sparkle like regular clear diamonds. Use a strong light. If it reflects colors like a rainbow, it may be glass or CZ cubic zirconia. Ash three, three missed scratch test, use with caution. Carbonado is one of the hardest natural substances like regular diamonds. How to do it? Try scratching glass or quartz with the stone. A real carbonado will scratch glass or even metal easily. Be careful not to damage the stone or surrounding surface. Don't scratch a mirror or anything valuable. How for heat test? Use a lighter carefully. Diamonds disperse heat quickly and should not get damaged. How to do it? Heat the stone with a lighter for about 30 seconds. Drop it into cold water. A real diamond, including carbonado, will not crack or shatter. Glass or quartz may break from the temperature shock. Do this test only if you're okay with possibly damaging the stone if it's fake. Ah, five, weight comparison. Carbonado is denser than glass or many other fakes. If you have a similarly sized glass or cis stone, compare the weight, a real carbonado will feel heavier. Six, conductivity test. If you have a diamond tester, most diamond testers measure thermal conductivity. However, some testers won't work well with black diamonds due to their polycrystalline structure. Final tip, use a jeweler's opinion. If you're still unsure, take the stone too, a local jeweler, a gemological lab, or send it for testing, e.g. GIA, IGI.